Welcome to the Cocktail Spirit from Small Screen Network. I'm your host, Robert Hess. Now, there are times when you find yourself in the morning and you just think it's time for a drink. What are you going to have? Well, you could have a Bloody Mary, you could have a mimosa, those are kind of the standard drinks. Or if you're down in New Orleans, one of the drinks you want to have is a bourbon milk punch. Let's take a look. It starts out with, of course, since it's called a bourbon milk punch, bourbon. Uh, matter of fact, we're going to add an ounce and a half of bourbon. And then to that we add two teaspoons of simple syrup. Now the, the sugar content in this drink can go up and down based upon your tastes. Sometimes you want a little bit sweeter, sometimes a little less sweeter, so you can adjust that uh, to whatever you want. And we add uh, two dashes of vanilla extract. Um, essentially, a vanilla extract is fairly strong. And if you don't have something with a dasher on it or eyedroppers, what you want to do is basically just pour out the smallest amount you can. Just add that vanilla flavor to it. And then we're going to add four ounces of milk or heavy cream, if you want. In this case, we're just adding regular milk. Um, you could use a low-fat milk, 2% milk, or I suppose even non-fat, but um, that just doesn't quite seem right. And I don't think a New Orleanser would ever do anything other than full-fat milk or even heavy cream. Um, then uh, we're going to take and shake this up with ice. Now, since it has milk in it or heavy cream of your choice, um, it's going to froth up a bit. It's not, not as much as if it had an egg white or something like that in it, but it's still going to be kind of frothy, and that's what we're wanting. So we want to shake it for a while so we can get that aeration into the milk. Should be enough. Now we're going to strain this into a, uh, a brandy snifter, one of the few things I'll use a brandy snifter for. I don't use this sort of glass for brandy itself. Um, I prefer a different style of glass. Uh, but for drinks like this or other kind of creamy drinks, it's kind of nice to use for it. And then we're going to grate the top with some nutmeg. The nutmeg just kind of adds this nice aromatic to the top of the drink as you drink it. Another aspect is the, the foam tends to take like, you know, soften and deaden some other flavors that might be coming up from the drink. And so the, the aromatics of the nutmeg are really nice. It's got a really nice foam, creamy layer in the top bit. You can kind of texture, you can feel as you drink it. And then as you break through that, you're actually getting into the drink. You've got the milk and the sweetness and a little teeny bit of vanilla. And that bourbon just kind of rounds out the entire flavor. Oh, it's excellent. Wonderful drink for the morning. Eggs, bacon, bourbon milk punch. What could be better?